Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the Margaritaville Key West Frozen Concoction Maker. Now you can buy this from Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price, 300 bucks. Now shout out to everybody who watched my Sunday night streams. Y'all see me drinking margaritas all the time. Well, the fun part about drinking margaritas is drinking them. The not so fun part is making them. So this machine should make the making them part a little bit more fun. All right, so let's unbox this and see what it is. All right, so here we go. The Margaritaville Key West Frozen Concoction Maker. Fantastic frozen drinks every time, no experience necessary. Now this is a big giant box. Party size ice reservoir. Extra large size holds ice for up to three batches. Spiller spoiler. Pour friendly jar and lid help prevent messy drips. Okay. Now I never used this before, so let's go through this together. Let's see. Here's your ice reservoir where the magic begins. Ice cubes go in here. Now here's your ice shaving motor. Steel blades shave up a blizzard of ice. You'll get all the credit. Now here's your ice chute. Shave ice comes out here. Mounds of the stuff. Here's your jar. Quality spirits, i.e. the good stuff, and other fine ingredients go here. You don't have to be Einstein to pass this chemistry class. Our jar whips up to 36 ounces of dividends. All right, so 36 ounce jar. Rim the glass with coarse, with coarse salt. All right, so you know how to do that. Now holla, come and get it. Retire immediately to the nearest hammock. I like, I like this stuff right here. Here's your handle. <laughs> it's the wheel of the ship and you're the captain. Hold it tight and don't let it go. He or she who pours the frozen concoctions rules the festivities. You know how that goes. Here's your controls, no brainer department. Automated settings and pre-programmed to shave ice and blend a half a jar or full jar of margarita perfection. For the adventure seeker, you got a manual settings allow you to customize margaritas to a texture befitting your personal taste. And here's your blending motor. Now this motor spins around faster than a bartender for a $5 tip. I like all this cute stuff. All right, so let's unbox this and see what you get inside. Rah. Little beast mode activity. Okay. Now this thing is kind of big, giggity. All right, let me pause the video, this is kind of heavy. All right, so here's everything that you get inside. You get your warranty. You get some other product information. They sell some other blenders. You get your user's manual with a few recipes. And you get a quick start guide. Now, usually I'd pluck this and file it to the side, but I'm actually gonna read it since I never use this and we'll make sure we do this right. Now, here's your ice reservoir. Caution, only put ice in here. Here's the top to your ice reservoir. Here's your blender, 36 ounces. Nice heavy weight on this, definitely feels like quality. And here's your Margaritaville frozen concoction maker. Now this thing is nice and heavy. Look at the build on this. A lot of chrome trim everywhere. Here's your Margaritaville insignia, Escape to Paradise. Let's see on the front, here's your on and off switch. You shave and blend, so you can shave ice and you can blend it manually, or you can use the uh, automated settings. Here's a shave and blend. Now you can also set how many cups you wanna make. So you got one cup, two cups, or three cups. On the inside, you have this like ship's anchor with a little uh, rope on it, that's a nice touch. On the back, let's see now. We'll figure out what this is in a minute. And I believe, all right, here's the plug. So this is nice how the plug stores in the back. This is gonna look so dope on your kitchen counter. Matter of fact, let's go upstairs and put it in the kitchen and see what it looks like. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. Now, a couple of things to mention. Remember that big reservoir that was in the back? That's just to catch the melted ice. And the second thing, it did come with a top. I just forgot to take it out the box. All right, so let's try this. Now, I got a 1,001 margarita recipes, but I'm gonna try one that came in the instruction manual. So I measured this out perfectly. These are all the ingredients. Okay, so we're just gonna dump them right into the blender. Now, this is supposed to be enough to make one drink. 
Okay, now we'll put the top back on and we'll slap this right in. Okay, make sure this is lined up. There we go. Now I'll open the top. We're gonna drop some ice in here. Okay, that should be good enough for one drink. Slap this back on. Just like that. Now we're gonna turn this on. Okay, I'm gonna set this to one drink. So now you notice you got that LED, that's one drink. Let me see, does it change? Nope, it doesn't change. All right, well, just, we'll set it to one drink. Now it says, hit, just hit up. Oh, let's see. Oh, shave and blend. There we go. Now it should do the rest automatically. Now let's see, the consistency does look good. Now if you wanted to add a little bit more ice, you would hit shave, put a little bit more ice in it, and then hit blend, and blend that up. Now that depends how thick or smooth you like your smoothies. Now for some garnishments. All right, so I got my salted margarita glass. Let's take this out of here. We hit the, now it does have a little pour top. And let's see how this came out. Does this top stay up? Oh, there it goes. Looks beautiful. Nice and thick. Giggity. Now, depending on what size, that looks like about enough for one cup. Now, let me do a little taste test. Oh my God. Perfect margarita. Hold up, I gotta, I gotta taste this again. This tastes exactly like something you would get from your favorite Mexican restaurant. Perfect consistency, no chunks of ice. Oh, this is delicious. One more sip. Whew. On a scale of one to 10, this is a major, major, major go. It's gonna look so dope on your kitchen counter. Oh, this margarita tastes, oh, I just got a little brain freeze. Margarita tastes delicious. Now, you don't only have to make margaritas, you can make your strawberry daiquiris. Make whatever you want, you know, play with it. But you see, you got your ice left over on the top. So now if I want, I can just take this reservoir off, put it in the freezer, keep my ice nice and cold. But I'm gonna make some more drinks and I'll do, I'll, I'll do another video showing y'all some of my favorite recipes. This is one of them. Buy this Jose Cuervo margaritas. Now it comes in a bunch of flavors. I got strawberry, got pina colada, raspberry, what else? Mango. Use uh when you make when you make your drinks, make sure you make your margaritas using 1800 or any type of tequila that's 100 percent agave. I right, do not use the Jose Cuervo dark. I know you might pay a couple of dollars more, but it is what it is. Get yourself some triple sec, some lime juice, and you're good to go. Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready, no meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat, Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad, I see y'all in the comment section early, hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing, I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Enterprise, Spock here. Spock, one to beam up. <laughs> <laughs>